what is yoga? What are the goals of yoga? You know, the answer to those questions are going to look a little bit different depending on kind of what, what tradition we're looking at. So again, to bring it back to the Yoga Sutra, uh, case in point, Patanjali very clearly gives his definition of yoga in Yoga Sutra 1.2, Yoga Shchitta Vritti Nirodha. Yoga is the cessation, the stilling, the Nirodha of the chitta vrittis, the turnings, the vrittis of the mind, of the chitta. So yoga here is actually a state. It's a state in which the activities and turnings of the mind come to a complete still. And that state of chitta vritti nirodha is yoga. And then Patanjali tells us, Tada, in the next sutra, Tada drashtu svarupe avastanam, then Tada, the drashtu, the seer, the inner self or witness, not the mind, beneath or behind or more subtle in the mind than the body itself, our true sort of inner identity that witnesses all that constant change of the mind that self, that drashtu, that seer, then rests of astanam in its own essence, its own nature, svarupa. So once one is in a state of yoga, a state in which all mental activity comes to a complete still point, uh, then awareness is able to actually turn in on itself and rest in its own nature rather than identifying falsely with the activities of the mind.